of street ballers here though. You saw Rui earlier. The Gonzaga men's and women's teams also were in attendance at Hoop Fest today. Yeah, for the men's team, Corey Kisper, Killian Tilly came down to greet the fans. I'll give you one guess if it was crowded or not. It was. Yeah. You probably knew that. The biggest news of the summer for Gonzaga men's basketball was the return of Killian Tilly for his senior season. He said he worked out for a couple of NBA teams this summer, and then there was some interest to draft him probably in the second round, but he wants to improve his draft stock by playing a full year healthy with Gonzaga. This is what he had to say about being a leader next season. Uh, I think I'm going to be one of the leaders of the team. I'm one of the the older guys, so uh, my role is going to be to you know uh, bring the everybody together, the the, the freshmen and the transfers, uh, uh, try to make everybody play like the Gonzaga way, and uh, it's going to be a good challenge. Yeah. Sorry, sorry, we're in show right now. Gonzaga women's basketball was also here at Hoop Fest today. Like you mentioned, Brenna, several players made appearances throughout the day, including Jill Townsend and Katie Campbell. Townsend is coming off a torn ligament in her ankle that ended her season last year in the WCC tournament. She needed surgery, but she's back, she's ready, and she hopes to take on more prominent role this season for the Zags. It's taking on a bigger role. Every year you get older, you have to step into a, a bigger role for the team, um, taking you know, more responsibility in uh, your quality of play and your leadership. And so, you know, it's going to be different from what I did last year, but um, I'm excited to get to it.